ericmothersmother.com. Let's take a look at GME and the question here is what to do after the drop over the last day or so. Now what I can see here on this five year weekly chart is I was trying to figure out where we see the resistance and it looks like we struggle to hold above the 61.8 level here. You can see that around that level of 61.8 seems to be some type of resistance right there. Now where does that resistance also come from from the chart? It looks like we are coming back to test this break. The break off the highs here in late 2015 and we can draw a uniformity line from there. It looks like this is where we came. We hit that level this week and of course we see this drop. Now the drop is of you know a decent size to the downside and the reason is because we are moving below RSI 50. So what we can gather from this chart is until we can clear the recent weekly closing high from last week, until we can clear this level, until we can clear above the blue line on the weekly, it seems to me that the stock should be net net sideways to down because of those challenges. So again here, this is now a two year weekly. We would need to clear last week's weekly closing high for there to be a strong uptick to the upside. Now that would generally need a stable to bullish market for that to happen. So that would be where we can get momentum to the upside. Otherwise it looks like we are stuck in a sideways to down trading environment. Keep in mind, if you go and take a look at the previous breakout attempts on the weekly, they seem to all have struggled and the stock has dropped after struggling to break out on the weekly chart. You can see lots of examples on this weekly chart here. Another failed breakout attempt here. And we can also see another failed breakout attempt all the way here. Now, of course, the worst thing that can happen to this stock is if the general market starts pulling back significantly the stock could easily get in trouble. So if the general market turns and starts being excessively down, or let's say the general market turns bearish, the stock would also suffer just because it has been down in a very strong market. The key here is it would need a weekly breakout to change the dynamics here and give the stock at least the open skies for higher prices. Right now, in my opinion, I would conclude by saying we are stuck in a sideways to down trading environment until the stock can clear the challenges as I've discussed here on the weekly chart. Eric Mother, Mother Dot com as always good luck, peace and blessings. E S E S. Whoa, yeah.